What's up, you guys? My name is Mary with HBI High Frequency Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Gemini, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general focus reading for sign of Gemini. This resonates if you have Gemini in any aspects of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, 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 Jupiter chart. Stuff with the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general focus reading. This is just in 96 for tentatively 11 12 of 2022 to 11 16 and 2022 this could resonate if you have gemini any aspects of your charts sun moon rising venus north moon and hand with jupiter charts don't forget the basics time is fluid energy is fluid if it doesn't apply that apply everyone has free will only take the messages to resonate leave the rest free general collective reading it's a tentative energy pool for the next four days of course there's 7.77 billion people in the universe so only take the messages resonate leave the rest Love you guys so much. Thanks for all the shares of my content. Thanks for all the new subscribers. Love you guys so freaking much. Just saying. Okay, from the bottom of my heart chakra. Okay, so this is for Sun Gemini. This for resonate if you have Gemini any aspects of your chart. So I encourage everybody to check out Elise or Sun Moon Rising signs. Just saying. I did receive two channel messages as I was meditating on your uh, Just in 96 energy, Gemini. The first message I heard, unexpected visitors soon. Some in a home space, some in a work space. And um, an Amazon order. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So an unexpected visitor soon. I feel it could be at your workspace if you work in the 3D or your home space or somebody you're connected to. But I feel for the majority of you guys, it's you. It's coming up in your energy. So an unexpected visitor, either in workspace or home space, I feel for the majority, it's going to be you they're visiting. For some, it could be somebody you're connected to. Home or workspace. And then Amazon delivery, this could be you receiving this Amazon delivery, whether it's a gift or you ordered it or somebody you're connected to. Some kind of Amazon delivery. You plug it in, how it resonates, Gemini. Okay, the Emperor upright, Nine of Wands upright, Two of Pentacles upright. You're a Gemini feminine, and your husband is about to become very jealous of another man. Talking to you a whole bunch. You were trying to heal the marriage. He's about to become very jealous. Oh, man. So you plug in how it resonates. There's nothing going on here. There's nothing going on here. Okay. Okay. So if this resonates for you, you're a Gemini Femme um, and you're married. You're legally married, Gemini Femme. You could have Gemini in any aspects of your charts, but you were legally married. Like I'm single to Pringle, hashtag legally single. But whoever you are, you're legally married and you're, you're, you have a husband. So you don't have a wife, you have a husband. And I heard you're trying to heal the marriage. So you're trying to heal the marriage with him, I'm presuming, or you're both trying to heal it, but it sounds like you're doing a lot of the work trying to heal it for sure. But he's about to get very jealous of another man. I heard he's, the other man's really talking to you a lot. I heard there's nothing going on there. I mean, you can talk to people and it not be any, you know, anything more than just verbal com communication. And it sounds like that's what this is. But your husband's about to get very jealous. Um, so I think in this aspect, we have the emperor upright, nine of wands upright, two of pentacles upright. I think this is your husband about to get very jealous. I think he's about to be an emperor reverse energy right now. He's emperor upright. Um, I think he, soon he's about to be emperor reversed. Now, this also could be the energy of the other man that you're just innocently talking to. I mean, upright, but when your husband gets jealous, it's, he's about to be emperor reversed. Jealousy, control issues, domineering, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. So for some, your husband could be a um, Aries possibly because this is Aries energy or not. You're about to stand up for yourself, your husband. Um, I heard there was marriage problems in the past. Um, and I'm assuming that's why you're trying to heal the marriage, trying to make it work. Two of Pentacles, he thinks you're juggling. I think he thinks for some you're cheating on him or he, he thinks you might cheat on him or what have you, what have you. But I heard there's nothing going on there. So if it was me, of course, you could take the advice or leave it. But if it was me, I would just straight up just tell him, dude, there's nothing going on. Um, if you think there are, we can get a divorce. 
I mean, of course, you don't have to say that if you don't want to this, but that's what I would say. Um, but I mean, there, if there's nothing going on, there's nothing going on. And I heard in this situation, there's not. So whoever you are, you're legally married and there truly is nothing going on. If there's nothing going on, you know, what is the bother in talking to another man? Just talking to them. Confirmation on my phone, by the way. And that's just the truth. There is no reason to get jelly in your jammies over a conversation. So if it was me, I would just calmly explain to him that there's nothing going on. And if he doesn't want to believe you, he doesn't want to believe you. Um, there has to be trust in a marriage, if he might need to hear this. There has to be trust there. Trust, honesty, morals, ethics, integrities, and values. If there's not that, then there's nothing in a marriage except for material materiality. If there is materiality there. I didn't hear there was. But I'm just being serious. Um, but I would just, I would talk to him. Okay? But I heard there's nothing going on there. But he think, I think he thinks you're juggling or he's afraid you might. Uh, with the two of pentacles. But it looks like you're about to start. You're about to stand up to him. In some of these situations, and I didn't hear this, but in some of these situations, it might be the other man about to stand up to him. Possibly, I didn't hear that, but it might come to that. Possibly, being accused of trying to hit on you or what have you, what have you, with the juggling energy. You are a Gemini fem, Mary Gemini fem. If this resonates for you. And a relationship with the Libra is about to tank into the ground. Tank into the ground. It was very rocky in the past. Low vibrational Libra. And a relationship with a low vibrational Libra is about to tank into the ground. Uh, I heard it was rocky in the past. Um, for some, it's someone you went to school with. For one, it's a family member. Okay, so for one of you guys, it was someone you went to school with. So that could be elementary school, middle school, um, private school, some kind of technical school, college, somebody you went to school with, um, Jim and I. And for one of you guys, it's a family member. But a relationship with a Libra, masculine or femme Libra, they can have Libra any aspects of their charts, and they're low vibrational. They don't treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. I heard your relationship with them is about to tank into the ground. I heard it's been rocky in the past, whether it's somebody you went to school with or a family member. How that resonates and applies, Jim and I. Um, for one, it's an ex-family member. For one, it's an ex-family member. So for one of you guys, it is someone you went to school with. For one, it is a current family member. For one, it is an ex-family member. But the relationship is about to tank, but I heard it was rocky in the past. So you plug it in how it resonates. I hope you guys, I hope this helped. I love you guys so much and namaste.